Austin police are saying they arrested someone at last week's protest there at UT who apparently had a loaded gun without a license to carry on campus. KXAN's Brianna Hollis has details on what happened. New court documents outline the arrest of 26-year-old Michael Mauls. During the protest that took place at UT on Monday, April 29th, police got a call about two protesters with guns. According to Mauls' arrest affidavit, police found him on campus at the protest with a loaded gun on his waistband and two loaded magazines in his pocket. The court document states he did not have a license to carry, which is, quote, required to possess a firearm on the premises of a post-secondary educational institution. So far, more than 100 people have been arrested in connection with protests on campus. Attorney George Lobb says the Austin Lawyers Guild is representing dozens of them, both students and non-students. But we are planning asserting speedy trial rights so that we get to a trial in the summer and get these cases set for a jury. He says most of the guild's cases involve people charged with criminal trespass. Previously, UT said actions that resulted in arrests violated the university's, quote, institutional rules and called DPS in for backup because protesters made note of wanting to, quote, occupy the campus. Brianna Hollis, KXAN News. Now, so far, UT has had a number of graduation ceremonies. All went as planned without any issues. Today, a message was shown before one event that says speech or assembly that disrupts the ceremony is not allowed, and anybody who breaks those rules will be removed from the venue.